Hi guys, it's your girl Janetta Ko here. Welcome back to my channel. So I feel like lately I've been starting my videos in the car. Is somebody waiting for me? Oh, lately I've been starting my videos in the car, which <laughs> is so weird. But today I have a few errands to run, a couple things to get done, and I decided to just go ahead and vlog it. So I'm actually about to head over to the car wash because I want to vacuum out my car. For those of you guys who don't know, um, you should know by now, but if you don't know, I am currently 30 weeks. Today is September the 8th, I believe. It's a Friday. I'm currently 30 weeks and I'll be 31 weeks on Sunday. Pretty soon, in the next few weeks, my son will be here. So I've been getting things. Me and my mom, we're gonna do like a big giant like shop. I think in October, we're gonna do a big shop to like get his bottles, his you know clothes, everything, like all the small little knickknacks. We're gonna get all of that stuff so of course i'll vlog that when that happens but i wanted to test out my car seat the car seat that i got and i want to actually clean out my car before i do that and my dad he's actually supposed to be treating me to get my car detailed before my son comes out but i want to make sure that the car seat that i have like everything is okay with it um just in case i have to return something because i did get it off of amazon so before i like put his car seat in here i at least want to like vacuum and do like you know clean it out okay because i do have like i haven't vacuumed my seats and like my floors in a little minute so before i put his car seat in here i want to go ahead and vacuum that so that's what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna show you guys his bassinet in his car seat once i get home i'll show you guys like all this new stuff that i got that you guys haven't seen because i think it's been a little minute since i've shown like stuff that i've gotten for my son like i think it's been a little minute since i've shown anything so once i get home i'll show you guys like the updated stuff that i got for him because time is ticking okay time is ticking and i just cannot believe that he's gonna be here in like 10 weeks almost nine weeks like that's just so crazy to me so let me get these floors vacuum let me just get my car together a little bit and yeah y'all just gonna watch me so we are finally leaving from vacuuming my car out and let me just say honey i definitely need to get it professionally vacuumed and like detailed because i did not realize how much that was gonna be on me like i don't know what i was thinking like sometimes i'd be moving as if i'm not pregnant like i don't know not saying that pregnant ladies can't vacuum out their car but girl like being in your third trimester trying to vacuum is not the vibe so i'm definitely going to take my dad up on his offer to get my car detailed because there's like little spots that i just cannot get especially on the driver's side of my car but for the most part i like cleaned it off as best i could i need to get some more like car wipes because the ones i had were dry girl and they're for actually like the glass they're not even for you know like the regular parts of the car but I, that was all i had i didn't have any other type of wipes <laughs> so yeah and they were dry as hell so i'm gonna have to get some more car wipes y'all my baby he was kicking me he was just like mom what are you doing like you just got my head bopping and moving around and you bending and doing all this stuff once i got to the back seat i had to sit down and vacuum like i couldn't like 
bend and do all that because that was just team too much but right now i'm heading to my bank because my bank has a coin dispenser thing and i'm going to put these coins in there i didn't fill it all the way up but this is how many coins i have i didn't fill it all the way up but honestly it's getting super heavy and i just want to empty it so supposedly my bank has like a coin thing and it just like automatically deposits the money into your account so i'm gonna test it out i've never tried it before but i'm gonna test it out today so yeah we're gonna go do that and then run our other errands oh, i've been so busy but i've been thinking about what i want to do with you i know that my other guys have been talking about the way i do what i do they heard i was good they want to see if it's true they know you're the one i want to give it to i can see you want me to now it's me and you now uh, i've been waiting waiting so i just did the coin thing that was my first time ever using like my bank's coin machine thing like coin dispenser and oh my gosh there's a bug in here ah! God, there's a bug okay <laughs> girl and tell me why i was only a gnat like what the heck i'm over here screaming about a little baby gnat okay i really need to wash my hands and i really need to pay so maybe we'll go to target for a little pit stop but let's see so out of all the coins there's a few coins that um i didn't realize were left over and i forgot to put them in there so i don't think one of them is an actual coin but there's a quarter and a dime that didn't make it in there and i didn't realize until after i put it until after i pushed done but the total amount that deposited in my account was twenty two dollars and thirty two cents from my coin jar so i love that for me make sure you guys keep your coins i used to not like i don't know i used to not like save my coins but now you know i like to save my coins so yes not too bad i'm actually i need to check and see if it really deposited in my account because like i said i never actually tried it before so let's see and they did give the option like if you wanted cash you can get cash as well but i just said deposit it in my account so let's see oh yeah it really did girl it really deposited in my account i love that for me right now i'm going to target because i need to make a pit stop and i like their bathrooms they're always like nice and clean and i feel like i need to wash my hands because i was touching the vacuums and stuff and then the coins like i feel like i just need to wash my hands <laughs> so i mean i've been using the hand sanitizer but you know you just feel like you need to wash your hands like i just feel like my hands need a good wash we are finally leaving tarjay don't y'all like kind of despise those people who stand outside the store and like they be trying to get you to sign stuff and donate and do all this extra stuff and it's just like mad annoying like sometimes i feel peer pressured into doing things that i don't want to do and i know that sounds ridiculous because i'm a grown-ass woman and it's like girl if you don't want to do something you don't have to do it but i don't know it's just like annoying like they be hassling you like before you go in they be like when you come out let me talk to you about this da, da, da. and it's just like no like i don't want to be hassled okay when i go in the store i don't want to sign nothing I don't want to donate nothing. Well, sometimes I donate because it'd be a good cause. But you know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes you don't feel like dealing with all that. So, where I live, um, I guess this guy was doing, like, a ballot or something. Not a ballot, girl. <laughs> it was, like, a petition, like, against the gas prices and, like, other stuff that my state has personally that they got going on. And it was a black guy. I'm not going to lie. He was kind of cute. <laughs> he was like, hey, ma'am, um, when you come out, like... Well, he was trying to get me to sign it before I went in, but y'all know I went to Target to use the restroom. So I was like, oh no, honey, like, sir, I'm not trying to hear none of that, okay? He was like, when you come out, let me talk to you. I want you to sign my da 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 da. I'm like, ugh. You know, so I did sign it. And then, mind you, I'm signing it because I am kind of mad about the gas prices. So I'm like, okay, yeah, you know, I'll sign it. But then that's how they get you because then they're like, oh, wait there's more stuff that i want you to sign because our state has other issues so could you sign this and it's like bro 
I only wanted to sign the gas one. Like, I didn't want to, so I sat out there in the freaking sun, hot as hell, just signing the different petitions when I only wanted to sign the one for the gas. Like, even though the other ones were fine too. Like, I didn't mind signing them, but it was just like, damn, like, how you gonna try to con me? And I don't think he realized that I was pregnant until he got closer. He's like, oh, you you got a little baby on the way. And I'm like, yes, I do. So I think he was probably assuming that I, I have a man. <laughs> y'all that happens like a lot like if people don't like they're not gonna look at you and automatically assume like you're a single mom like i hope not but you know so a lot of people think like when they see me and they see that i'm pregnant they're like oh well yeah she got a man like so they be like oh um is you and dad happy blah 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 like are you guys happy for your new addition and i have to be like oh it's just me <laughs> so i think that he was trying to like you know get me to sign the petition but he was also trying to like you know, he was cute though. I'm not gonna lie, he was a cute guy. He was a really cute guy. And I usually don't do dreadheads, but he was really cute. And then once he seen my stomach, he was like, oh, I didn't know he was expecting. I'm like, yep. So he was probably like, well, never mind. She got a man. <laughs> and it's like, sir, I do not have a man. Little do you know. But anyways, yeah. Let me know if you guys ever run into stuff like that when you're going in the store. Like, I always run into that type of stuff at Walmart, but not Target, girl. Like target since when did y'all have these people outside pestering us before we walk in a store <laughs> let me know if i'm the only one like who doesn't really like that I just feel like it's annoying like huh, like i hate the ones that pester you like let me donate if i want to donate let me donate like i see your sign i see what your cause is all about if i want to donate i'll come to you but don't pester me and be like when you come out the store come over here like no let me enjoy my day and if i want to donate or sign i'm gonna donate and sign like <laughs> but that's my mini rant of the day now i'm going to walmart and let's hope that there's nobody out there pestering me again okay all right so we are in walmart vlogging from my phone low-key i like sleeping in oversized shirts like this Look at this. This would be so cool to sleep in. Like, I don't like wearing, but girl, who's paying $12.99? Like, this is what I'd be saying. If this was like $5, then I might've gotten it. But like, $12.99? Girl, <laughs> But this is kind of like what I want. Like, I want something to sleep in. Like, I don't like sleeping in regular pajamas now because it'd be uncomfortable, you know? Like, when you're in your third trimester, you just want to be comfy. But these are so cute. I didn't come in here to look at these. Okay, this one's $8. That's not bad. Look at that. I need it to be super big. Like, I need it to cover. It covers me. It covers me pretty well. Okay, well, I'm not mad at that. That price is reasonable. $8. But then it's like, can I go to Ross and find something cheaper? See, this one's $5. Girl, I might have met my match. Look at me over here talking. I ain't even looking at all the options. Okay, so this is the one that's $5. It says, take my, I don't use it anyways, advice. <laughs> kind of like that. But is it big enough to sleep in? Like, I want my shirt to be huge. Like, big, big. These are only $5. Okay, so they're all different prices. Like, some are $5, some are $10. This one's five. Oh no, girl, we ain't doing that one. No, we ain't doing that one. Anymore. We don't do wishes or nothing like that. What to say? <laughs> it says, admit it. Life will be boring without me. Okay, now I like that. That's cute. I oh, know that's right. Now, this is an extra, extra, extra large. I just wanted to sleep in. I feel like it'd be great to sleep in. I don't know. We're gonna think about it, but let me get what I actually came in here for first, and then <laughs> then we'll look at the extra stuff later. Oops, excuse me. Damn. About to take me out the game. Shit. Yeah, I swear these people today kind of they're kind of they're kind of here. I, I've had it up to here <laughs> with the people today. Okay, but I came in here to get iron supplements because my midwife said that I need to start taking iron and I also need to get some more mouthwash so let's go. Now look there you got some foam pumpkins out. These are cute. 
I like these. Kind of makes me want to decorate for fall. Now, baby, tell me if you like it. Tell me if you like it. So my last and final stop is going to be Taco Bell. I really want tacos and I don't feel like cooking them. So I'm going to go to Taco Bell. I know, I know, but listen, okay? I don't feel like cooking homemade tacos. So we're going to get Taco Bell. And then once I go home, I'm going to show you guys my, the stuff that I got for my son so far that I haven't already showed you guys. Because there's like a few things like towards the beginning, like in a very old vlog, I think that I showed you guys like a few stuff but I did get like a couple of things like I said I haven't really done like a giant shop like a big thing like I haven't really gotten a whole bunch of things yet because um, I'm waiting to go shopping with my mom in October because that's when we're gonna get like the bottles and you know more clothes onesies like stuff like that I just been kind of buying stuff here and there when I see it and then like I said we did get some of the bigger things already like his bassinet car seat the stroller so I'm gonna show you guys that stuff once I get home I was gonna put his little car seat what are you doing dang people just be flying out like sir ma'am do you not see me coming down the street I was gonna put his car seat back there like I said earlier but y'all I'm actually tired like I know that sounds so crazy because I barely did anything but I'm done, honey. I'm done. I think I'm going to wait till tomorrow and have my mom or my dad help me with it to like put his little car seat in there and strap it in and stuff. Because I already know once I eat this Taco Bell, I'm probably going to take a nap. <laughs> I'm probably going to watch a movie and take a nap. I'm not even going to hold y'all. So this, this video is probably going to be really short. But it's just like a cute little solo diary, you know, day in my life. A cute little vlog, you know, something. I did want to go to Ross and Marshall's and TJ Maxx because I was kind of in a shopping mood. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to save that for a different video. So I think next time we're going to do like a shopping video. So we're back home. I want to show you guys um, my car seat, my stroller. I got this car seat and this stroller from Amazon. I think my dad he sent me i think i paid 197 all together it came with the car seat the stroller and like the little attachment thing that you put in your car so i thought that was a good bang for your buck and you know i'm a first time mom so you know i'm just glad that i was able to get all of this for 197 basically 200 dollars um so i'm going to show you guys what it looks like so here it is this is the stroller car seat combination it's like a little jogging set like a little jogging stroller i really like it um this is the car seat has this little newborn little headpiece there and then of course you can cover it and do it like this it's really easy to put together honestly i just have to put the wheels on and then it has like this little peekaboo thing where you can look and see and then these two here and of course it has this little middle piece here um and the stroller is really lightweight as well. The only thing that I didn't like about this stroller, I don't know if you guys can see, but it kind of has this little bulge on the side. And I was talking to my mom and my dad about that. Like, kind of like when you move it forward, it has like that little lump, it looks like. I don't know if you guys can tell, but that's the only thing I really didn't like about this, but it's not like super noticeable. Like when I push it, it still feels like not too bad, but <laughs> yeah that's the only thing everything else was literally perfect about this stroller and car seat combo it's just this wheel and i didn't really feel like taking the whole thing back but at the same time it's kind of like okay i paid 197 like i want everything to be right you know what i mean so 
I don't know. I have until November, I think they said November 29th to return it. And my due date is, um, my due date is November 12th. So if this is just an absolute no, then I'll just take it back. But like I said, I'm not super bothered by that, but it is kind of annoying because like when you pay for something, you want it to be all the way right. And it kind of feels like they gave me a will that somebody else already used because, oh, I'm out of breath, y'all, sorry. <laughs> the will was already kind of like dirty when I got it. So would I recommend this? Yes and no. Like even the reviews, it had a lot of good reviews. And then it wasn't until recently where they started having a lot of bad reviews. And this is my second time ordering this because the first time I ordered it, um, they had to send it back to the warehouse or something for some reason. So this was my second time ordering it. I never got the first one. They had to ship it back. And yeah, so I finally got it the second time around. And um, yeah, and like once I started looking at the reviews, I started seeing like the most recent reviews and those weren't as great. Like when I first seen this stroller and car seat combo, the reviews were great. Like I was like, okay, this should be a good bang for my buck. But then like, it wasn't until after I got it and I started seeing the more recent reviews, people were talking about the tires kind of being weird and something else. So I was like, girl. <laughs> So I don't know, that's the only thing I don't like about it is that one wheel, but I feel like it can be fixed, I don't know. But that is his stroller and car seat combo. I'm gonna put it back over here and out of the way. So we're on, this is how I'm gonna look, pushing my little baby. Okay, look at that, look at that. <laughs> it's so cute, I really like it. So this is how it would look pushing him around so I'm not too mad at it for the price I'm not that mad at it so before I get all comfy and I get my pajamas and stuff because like I said y'all I'm probably just gonna eat my Taco Bell and watch some movies and relax for the rest of the day um not gonna lie to you but before I do that I want to show you guys what I got from Walmart um I only got three things from Walmart two of the things were on my list the other thing was not on my list so I got some more Listerine, but I just got the small one. I need to start getting the bigger one. And then I got these iron supplements. My midwives told me I need to start taking some iron um, every other day. And they told me to get the 65 um, MG one. So this is the one that I got. I'm gonna test this out and see how this works. So I need to start taking this. Um, and then the last thing I got was the Bodycology whipped vanilla body cream i've actually never tried their body creams before so i'm really looking forward to trying this i do have the perfume i bought the perfume the other day um well actually i think i bought it last week so i bought it last week and then i seen this they had this in stock so i was like you know what? i'm gonna try this out so i got this it was only like three four dollars so i'm gonna see how this works out for me and then that was all i got from walmart and then now i'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff that I got for my baby boy. Um, I don't know if you guys have already seen these, so I'm just gonna start with these first. So the first thing that I have here is this Nike two-piece set. It's for zero to six months. So it has the little socks, the little Nike socks, and it has the little Nike hat. And I got this from Burlington, it was $6.99. So I had got this a little while ago, but yeah, this is one of the things I got. Not sure if you guys seen this already, cause I don't remember if I showed it in a video or not. Then the next thing I got was kind of like the same thing, but this is by Puma. So this is the hat and booty combo. And this is, this was $3.99 from Burlington. So it looks like this. And you got the little socks, his little Puma socks and the little Puma hat. And this is also size zero to six months. And then I got another Nike set. So this is the Nike two-piece set. And this one is actually the bib and the socks. So it looks like this. I thought this was so cute. Like, look at that. <laughs> that is so cute. So I got this for $5.99. That's what I got for there. And then the next thing, I think I might have shown you guys this already. I don't know. Forgive me if I did. But I got this Adidas onesie. And this is for zero to three months. And it looks like this. I thought this was so cute. Like, look at it. And the little booties. The little sock things. It's like a little one piece. 
and then it just like zips up and down i feel like it's gonna be perfect um he is gonna be born in the winter time he's gonna be a winter baby so i definitely need a lot of one pieces so yeah i got this from burlington as well for 5.99 i still have the tag on it <laughs> so yeah i got that and then these last three items are like my most recent clothing purchases so i got this nike one piece set and i actually got this from marshall's and this was on clearance for five dollars yeah so it was on clearance for five dollars it was originally 6.99 i'm not even sure why it was on clearance if i'm being honest with y'all i don't see anything wrong with it but this is actually for three months so he probably won't be able to fit this until he's like three months but who knows they did tell me that he is going to be on the smaller side so like about six pounds so yeah i don't know if he's going to be able to fit this when he comes out but yeah this is what it looks like it's a basic old onesie with the nike sign on it super cute and then i got this so this one is the tahara baby three-piece bodysuit pants and cap set i got this from marshall's as well for 7.99 as y'all can see and this is what it looks like i love this one like this one just screamed fall and just like i don't know it just gave me fall halloween vibes you know with the colors i love like the tan and the orange and the brown so yeah this one is zero to three months and like i said he's gonna be born in november so i feel like this was very fitting for the season that he was born in these are the pants i thought they looked so cute and look at the little hat it's orange I'm not sure how he's going to be able to fit this when he comes out, but if he can't fit it right away, he can obviously grow into it. So I got that. And then the last thing is like my all time favorite. This is by Rachel Zoe. Um, it's the three piece set. It's a bodysuit pants and slouchy hat set. This was also $7.99 from Marshalls. Look at this y'all. Like y'all cannot tell me this is not cute. Like look at this so it got the little bodysuit and i love the material it's like that ribbed material and then look at the little pants like the pants are just the cutest little thing like look at this oh my gosh this is so cute and then it has a little slouchy hat like this and the hat is gray i thought that this was so cute when i seen it and even the ladies when i was checking out the cashiers like they were like that is so cute and i was like right like i feel like it just be the perfect little lounge set or if i take them out somewhere i just feel like this would be the perfect little set and i think i want to pair i know this already comes with the hat but i kind of want to do these two like wouldn't this be cute and they're literally the same color so like the nike hat with the nike booties and then the little the little um set like i feel like this would be so cute it looks like it goes together nicely so i'm definitely gonna like pair him up in this together i thought that that was like the cutest little thing so yeah i absolutely love this and that was like the last thing that i got that i don't think you guys um seen and then i have a big box of pampers that my dad got me so shout out to my dad and then i'm gonna show you guys his basket I'm also moving. I'm going to be moving very soon. So the way that my room looks and the way that it's set up is going to be different. All right, you guys. So ignore that down there. Like I said, I'm in the process of moving. But this is his basket I also got this off of Amazon. And my aunt actually got this for me off of my registry. Um, this thing does come down right here. That's why it has like the zippers. So this comes down. I'm not gonna put it down right now um, just because I don't feel like zipping it back up and I'm kind of getting hungry not gonna lie so yeah so I just have all his stuff in here I haven't ordered his dresser yet so I have like some newborn pampers some wipes some more pampers the stuff that I just showed you guys like blankets his little giraffe with his heartbeat in it isn't that just so cute <laughs> so yeah that's his giraffe with his heartbeat in there but yeah i love this basket it actually raises up this is the lowest that i have it i have it like on the lowest um setting but it actually goes all the way up <laughs> so yeah this is what the basket looks like this i actually would recommend i think this is like 110 dollars and i absolutely love this basket i have to get like some basket sheets and stuff but yeah this is what the basket looks like um like i said ignore the mess i'm moving right now that's my taco bell drink so don't mind that but yeah so this is his 
bassinet is what he's gonna be sleeping in and then like i said my dad had bought me this big old box of pampers i did open it me and my mom opened it because we wanted to see like what the sizing looks like so yeah he got this big old box of pampers also so yeah so yeah y'all like i said that's pretty much all the stuff that i have right now i do have to get his dresser his dresser i'm also going to get off of amazon that's like fifty dollars sixty dollars so that's not bad but i want to order order that when i'm in um, my new place so i'm not going to order it right now i'm moving like two weeks so yeah and then in october when me and my mom do like the giant like the big giant shop i'm gonna obviously take you guys with me i cannot wait for that like we both just can't wait but yeah i think this is pretty much going to be the end of today's vlog i was gonna take his car seat and set up set it up in my car but i just y'all i think i'm done for the day so um if i do end up doing that i'll come back and show you guys but i think this might be the end of today's vlog it was very short and simple and sweet so i hope that you guys enjoyed it but um yeah if this is the end of today's video don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias it'll be down below in the description box with the direct links thank you guys so freaking much for watching and of course as always i'll see you guys in my next video Bye, you guys.